What is going on YouTube and Weight Loss Warriors? It's your boy C Dub, and I'm back with another video. And today I want to talk to you about whether or not intermittent fasting helps you detach from food. And I'm going to do it right after this. My name is C Dub, and welcome to my channel. If you're new, I lost 125 pounds using the OMED method of intermittent fasting. And if you're returning, thank you so much for your support. And today, I wanted to talk to you guys about intermittent fasting and whether or not that helps you detach from food. And that's a weird way of putting it or, or a different way of thinking about it. But I noticed that when I started intermittent fasting, very early on, within a couple of weeks, I stopped worrying about food as often and since that day that I started all the way until now, 17, 18 months later, I have begun to move farther and farther away from food in this weird kind of way. So I wanted to say that I think that as you get going in intermittent fasting, we are, prior to that, so addicted to food and it's so driven down us through marketing and through advertisements and, and, and celebrations and all of the wonderful things that we do in our life all revolve around food and it begins to be such a major important part of our existence and our being and just being on the planet and enjoying it and being around people and how it ties together socially and it's just such a part of the human element that it begins to be a part of our DNA to eat all of the time and to be into it and then you get into fasting and you have to force yourself to step away from that and to only eat at certain times and what happens is you begin to stop worrying about eating and the second you stop worrying about eating you start to realize that you don't need to eat and then things like long-term fasts or, or, or other things are just made super easy uh, I, you know, I've said several times on this channel that some days I'm moving and grooving and shaking and baking and I look over at the clock and it's past my normal eating hour and most of the time I'll say, oh well, and I'll just wait till the next day to eat. That is something that is powerful. It's powerful in the sense that you don't have to be controlled by food any longer. And once you realize that food is not in the driver's seat in your relationship, that food is now a passenger, everything changes. And so you become detached from food and you no longer need food in the way that you needed food before. Of course, we obviously know if you don't have food, eventually it's not going to work out too well for you. But you do realize that you don't have to have it daily or hourly or whatever and that you can go long periods of time without eating and it does not have to dictate your day. It does not have to dictate your celebrations. It does not have to dictate anything at all and a really uh, wonderful example of that is getting back into school we have the meetings and we have luncheons and we do all of those things that you do when you're getting ready for a school year and that I can sit down knowing that it's not my window with my colleagues and not eat at all and nobody questions me nobody gets on me about it they all know it's part of me now I'm pretty much an open book about it now in intermittent fasting whereas before I hid that kind of thing and it's just a part of who I am and I know that I don't need to eat to be social. I don't need to eat because I feel forced to do so. I want to eat because I need the energy or I need the food and that is the only reason that I need to eat and that is a powerful thing. So in clicking on this video you wanted an answer to the question. I absolutely think intermittent fasting and OMAD will teach you how to detach yourself from food, how to back away from it for a second, and how to say, do I really need what I'm sitting here eating, or is it something that I can push off to another day? And I think when you get to that perfect spot, it's life-changing stuff. I hope you appreciated this video. You're gonna see my face pop up right over here. If you have not done so, click on it. Help me get to 2,000 subscribers as I continue to grow this channel. Share it with your friends. Click on these other videos and stay on my channel. I appreciate all of you. Thank you. Peace.